Fora TV. The world is thinking. The fact that your brain does not reside in a homogeneous state across the 24-hour period. In fact, your brain will actually oscillate through a variety of different what we call brain states, going from being awake to being asleep, even into different stages of sleep. And that's an important point. We actually do have different types of sleep. And so to sort of break that apart, um, human sleep has broadly been classified into two main types, as many of you may know. On the one hand, we have uh, non-rapid eye movement sleep or non-REM sleep. And non-REM sleep has been further subdivided into four separate stages, um, unimaginatively called stages uh, one to four, uh, increasing in their depth of sleep. So stages three and four is that really sort of deep restorative sleep, that dreamless sleep. Whilst on the other hand, we have rapid eye movement sleep or REM sleep, um, named not after the uh, popular Michael Stipe band, um, but because of these rather bizarre horizontal shuttling eye movements that occur during the stage of sleep. Function, completely unknown. Now, let me just ask a quick show of hands. Um, how many people in the last 24 hours uh, were psychotic? <laughs> One or two. We've got a good crowd, so uh, about average. It turns out you all should have put your hands up because everyone here, as long as you slept last night, became flagrantly psychotic. In fact, many times. Now, why would I bestow that diagnosis of a nightly psychosis on you? Well, I'll give you three good reasons as to what happens when you're in REM sleep, which is the stage where dreaming comes from. Firstly, you start to see things which are not there. So you're hallucinating. Secondly, you believe things that could not possibly be true. So you're delusional. And then you wake up in the morning and you forget most, if not all, of that dream experience. So you're suffering from amnesia. It's very strange. Now, it's